Hey guys, welcome back to Rule 16. I am your host Javon, and today we're testing out Life is Strange Before the Storm on my Intel Core i5 7200U with Intel HD graphics 620 and 8 gigabytes of RAM. We're gonna see how Life is Strange runs on this. Well, right now it's not doing great <laughs> at 20 FPS. But what if I told you right now I had the game maxed out at 768p and I'm very hella high. That's right, I said hella high because that's a setting. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I love that. But anyway, yeah. It's not doing great like that. Let's try and turn off shadows because I hate shadows. And the game comes alive already. You see there's still shadows around. It's on low. So around midway, you can get about 25 to 27, 20, even 28 FPS without fast recording. And yeah, it plays kind of nicely. But if you really want to get even higher than this, let's see. Resolution is always a thing. I will not take no anti-aliasing or effects quality. We want 60. Let's drop it to the lowest first. Then we'll go back up and see how things go. You can get about 50 FPS. With a preset that I had that actually disabled shadows. I mean, had shadows really low. You can get 60 FPS. But I put them back on for the sake of this video. Because, yeah. I don't want to show you guys. I actually edited out the shadows. But you can edit out the shadows. Not sure how the hell I did that at this point though. How the hell did I do that? It's been a while. I gotta go check that out. <laughs> but yeah, the game runs quite nicely. And if you want to keep it at 30 with some quality, let's just drop it down to 950, 960 by 540. And the game will play at a smooth 30 frames per second without a problem. Without a hitch in it. And yeah, this is Life is Strange before the storm, guys. But like I said, with out the shadows completely disabling the shadows, the game can be played much high, at much higher resolution. Everything gives you a much higher resolution and it's great. A lot more frames and yeah. This is Life is Before the Storm guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe and stick around for more of my content. Leave a comment down below again like you see me test up. I'm testing a bunch of games on my integrated graphics today and yeah. See you guys next time.